Hi, I'm BJ Trollio, co-inventor of the putting arc. Um, when I was younger, playing junior golf, college golf, mini tours, you know, basically this is how we worked on putting. We sat out there and we saw how many putts we could make from three feet, or we saw maybe we could make from 10 feet, or we putted to rent to, toward fringes for speed, which is all good stuff, but we really didn't have a great way of working on our stroke. And so the putty arc came from the idea that the putter is going to move on a plane. Um, the, as it moves on that plane, the face of the putter needs to stay square to that plane for, for constant and consistent strikes in the middle of the face. And also that we need to have some idea of what the putter face rotation is doing while it's there. So that's where the putty arc came from. Come on over, we'll take a look and I'll show you how to use it. Uh, the putting arc is an is on plane stroke and the reason we made it an arc on the ground is so that people could really quickly see when the face of the putter was square to the plane and you can see it so quick here right there so that stroke stayed square to that plane back and through and on the heel side here we are same way so it's so quick to see if there's any deviation if there's anything weird happening in the face, it's so easy to see. So we recommend using the heel side and the toe side a little every day. The, the other drill that we've always recommended is keeping the putter head equal distant. It's a little harder drill, but it does a really good job in letting you clean it up, and it gets you off having to use the aid all, always. It helps you to see what you're really building. So here I'm going to keep the heel of the putter equal distant from the arc as it moves back and through. Move back and through, and you'll see little wiggles when you first start, and then the wiggles kind of go away. So now I know that I'm starting to ingrain this motion. I'm not just always using a training aid for no reason. I can see how it's changing my path, making it on plane, and using changing my face rotations. So it's so easy to see, you know, it's so easy to see your members or, or even tour players. A tour player might go back and open that face a little too much, or Tour player, uh, that's typically what you're going to see. A tour player might get too into release and start releasing the face too much off-plane motion. So now I've created a good stroke that was on plane and that also had face that stayed square to that, that plane or that path. Now, the other thing we're really excited about is this mirror. And the mirror gives us two things. One, it gives us uh, an idea to be able to see our head to make sure it's staying stable. If the head's not moving, that means the lower body's not moving. That's a big key to, to solid putting. And so here I can walk in, I'll put it on the toe side here. I can see my eyes. They're not over, the, this projection of my eyes is not over the line of the putter. It's out there so that I can literally just see my head. And now I'm gonna make strokes back and forth, sensing that my head is very still, I can see this. So if I were wandering around any this way or this way, I could see that real quick. The other item we're really excited about is being able to, for people to, to check and monitor their shoulders. And so open shoulders are all way too common, way too common in putting. Everybody seems to kind of walk in and get the shoulders jacked up. So here, it's really easy for me to see my shoulders are square. So I'm building a stroke from a solid foundation. I'm building an on-plane stroke. I'm taking care of any face rotation. So this is how we advise using the putting arc. It's been around, it's been all over the world and worked with the, the best players in the world have used the device just because of its simplicity, and you can see so many things. That way, when you're building a good stroke, when you come out here to hit putts, it's so much easier to be confident and, and get your mind thinking about making the putt as opposed to controlling the face. So enjoy your putting arc, and have a great 2014.